There are so many ranks in the US Army, and they can be so confusing. In this episode, we'll look at the US Army ranks in their correct order. Earned during basic training, Private is the lowest enlisted rank. This rank does not carry an insignia. Next, after completing basic training, most soldiers will receive the rank of Private Second Class. Within a year, soldiers will typically be promoted to Private First Class. Next, we have Specialist and Corporal. You'll notice the E4 next to each of them. This is referring to their pay grade. Specialists are generally put in charge of lower ranked enlisted soldiers, and they'll generally have less responsibilities than a corporal. Next, we move on to the more leadership roles. Here, a sergeant. Following that, we have a staff sergeant, which have similar duties to a normal sergeant, but they'll generally be in contact with a larger amount of soldiers. Sergeant First Class is up next. They generally have 15 to 18 years of military experience. The Master Sergeant is considered as the principal non-commissioned officer at the battalion level. The First Sergeant's role is generally for discipline and counselling of the soldiers in his unit. The Sergeant Major's role is the Chief Administrative Assistant for any Army Headquarters. The Command Sergeant Major is the enlisted advisor to the commanding officer. Finally, with the Sergeants, you have Sergeant Major of the Army. There is only one Sergeant Major in the entire Army. He serves as the Senior Enlisted Advisor and consults the Chief of Staff of the Army. Warrant Officer 1 Warrant Officers are known as the Adaptive Technical Experts, Combat Leaders, Trainers and Advisors. We then move on to Chief Warrant Officer 2. Chief Warrant Officer 3. Chief Warrant Officer 4. And finally, Chief Warrant Officer 5. As the rank increases, so does the responsibility and expertise. Second Lieutenant. This is the entry level rank for the majority of commissioned officers in the Army. First Lieutenant. Generally obtained after 18 to 24 months of service. Captain. Captains will generally be put in charge of a company. Major. They're considered field grade officers and they'll serve as a primary staff officer for the brigade. Lieutenant Colonel. At this rank, they'll be put in charge of battalion sized units. Colonel. They normally are put in charge of and command brigades. Brigadier General. They serve as the deputy commander to the commanding general for army divisions. Major General. They'll typically command a division unit. Lieutenant General. Their main job typically consists of commanding corp size units. General. At this rank, they command all operations that fall under their geographical area. And finally, you have General of the Army. However, this rank is only used during times of war. What rank do you think is the backbone of the US Army? Let us know in the comments section down below. As always, if you've enjoyed this video, leave a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for similar content.